What's up guys, Demon here back with another video, and I'm on the Locust Grove Trail. This is kind of where it starts. There's a lot. It's a big police. And yeah, we're gonna walk through it. Here are the rules. Have to make sure it doesn't say no recording. There's a bench here. Here's what it says. There's a sign Wildlife Sanctuary. Stuff. Here, we're gonna go the up route instead. This is lane loop. There's a fence here. There's a building here. Shops and stuff. It's another bench here. Here's the, that way is back to the house, that way is the lane loop, huh, it's both ways I guess, and then Hudson River is that way, I don't know what I mean by that, I don't think the Hudson River is connected to here, it might be, and there's a south one so. I came across this. Oh, and there's the two. I'm not sure why that's there. It's an uprooted tree. This wasn't here last time that we saw. So, there's this puddle of water here in the middle. Avoid the water. It's like a waterfall kind of. It's interesting. And that's... Oh! It's terrible. Alright, Julian. There first, slowly. It's pretty cool. This looks really barren compared to the other areas. I like it. There's some kind of tree. Or plant here growing inside of this. Wow. Anyways, there's spiky wood. Oh. Looks like something in a trap. There's a log. There's some houses right there, and they look huge. It's kind of getting blocked, but also really big.
this is an area that's roofed by leaves hanging down. Oh, there are berries on it. This looks like some kind of sumac. More sumac down there. Probably didn't see it. There's the sun. You can use that as a marker. Which direction we're going. And even the time. You don't really need the time because it's on my phone though. It's another. Okay, sorry. South Loop Trail. Oh. And the Ravine Trail. And also the South Loop Trail again. Where is it? I don't see it on the phone. Oh, yeah, there it is. Without a map or anything, you can tell where you are. This all looks the same. It's just woods, trees, and leaves on the floor. Down there, it's the signs. Besides those signs ahead, there's still nothing special to see. It's the same thing. I happen to find a bed rolling down the floor. It's nasty. Flipped it over. I don't know what happened to it. Do some of that. Here we are. Looks like the Heineken beer logo. We're taking There's Cascade, Cascade trail, which is where we are. South Loop Trail. We're going to go past a pond, yeah. a lake, Lakeside Trail. Cascade with. Trail again. And a bench. And you can see the sign used to be here, but someone took it off. I'll never know what it said. So here's probably the biggest waterfall here. Goes under this bridge and it leads out here. I just found a stone wall there. It's the Great Wall of Locust Grove. It's another um, waterfall and it leads through the like, stone tunnel out there. Ah, Sounds like no, I forgot the name of it, but it's like it doesn't have that signal on the speaker. Anyways, it's like a marsh there. All right, so I'm in the woods biome. Now I'm entering the marsh biome. Over there, you could see the house. It looks like it's some kind of construction that's going on there. So I'm editing with this app, Clips, as you know, probably. And it can zoom really far, like unnecessarily far. Ooh, looks like hat tails. Anyway, look at this. You can see the molecular structure. That's how far it zooms in. You can see the electrons moving around. Here's another tunnel. Water, pond. 
Cascade Lakeside. Now we've entered the swamp biome. All right, so we're gonna head back now. So I'll just end the video because you guys have seen this part. Yeah, that's it for the video, guys. Make sure to like and subscribe. We'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, spectators.